The U.S. Air Force USAF, will upgrade the old F-16 fighter aircraft to a modern and sophisticated fighter standard. The USAF has released improvements to the latest software and hardware that are planned for more than 600 F-16 Fighting Falcon fighters, said USAF, reports Jane's. The M-Series 7.2 Plus Operational Flight Program OFP Upgrade Program, intended for the current F-16 Block 40 40 seconds 50 50 second retrofit, was released in April after the U.S. Dollar F-16 System Program Office SPO, Development Program 455 million carried out at the Hill Air Force Base AFB in Utah and Wright-Patterson AFB in Ohio. As noted by the USAF, the OFPM 7.2 Plus upgrade adds 42 key capabilities to the older F-16 variants, including the Northrop Grumman and APG-83 Active Electronically Scanned Array AESA, radar. This series radar, considered a top priority for the North Command, USNORTHCOM. In addition the upgrade also allows the F-16 to use the AGM-158B Joint Air-to-Surface Standoff Missile Extended Range Jazimur Cruise Missile and the latest variant of the AIM-120D Advanced Medium Range Air Long Range Missile to Air Missile IMROM, with an upgrade to the APG-83 radar, making the F-16 Block 40 40 seconds 50 50 seconds nearly parallel to its radar capability with the F-35 and F-22 Raptor fighters. In addition, its capabilities are equipped with AMROM AIM 120D missiles and AGM 158B air to surface cruise missiles make older F 16 warplanes more capable and can be assigned to a variety of complex missions. The F-16 Fighting Falcon is a supersonic multi-role fighter jet developed by the General Dynamics Company, later acquired by Lockheed Martin, for the United States Air Force. It was originally designed as an air superiority fighter but eventually evolved into a very popular multi-role fighter. The ability of the F-16 to be used for all kinds of missions is what makes it very successful in the export market, and is used by 24 countries other than the United States. This aircraft is very popular in the eyes of the international and has been used by 25 air forces around the world. The F-16 is the largest and most significant Western Bloc fighter project with around 4,000 F-16 units already in production since 1976. This aircraft has not been manufactured for the United States Air Force but is still produced for export. In 1993 General Dynamics sold the aircraft manufacturing business to Lockheed Corporation, which subsequently became part of Lockheed Martin after a merger with Martin Marietta in 1995. The F-16 itself is known to have excellent combat capability in the air, with innovations such as a frameless cockpit lid that clarifies vision, side grip handles for easy control at high speeds, and cockpit seats designed to reduce the effect of G-force on pilots. This aircraft is also the first fighter aircraft made to withstand the turning power at 9 grams acceleration. The F-16 has an M61 Vulcan rifle inside the fuselage and 11 pylon locations to carry weapons and other mission equipment. The official name of the F-16 itself is Fighting Falcon, but Viper is more commonly used by ground crews and pilots due to its similarity to the Snake Viper AD and Starfighter Colonial Viper from the Battlestar Galactica TV show. The F-16 is now active in the United States Air Force, the Air Force Reserve Command, and the National Air Guard Unit. This aircraft is also used by the Air Force in 25 other countries. Until 2015, this aircraft is the most rigid winged aircraft used by military branching in the world.
The F-35 is the result of the development of the X-35 aircraft in the Joint Strike Fighter program. This aircraft is a single-seat, single-engine supersonic fighter that can perform many functions, including air-to-air -air combat melee air support and tactical bombing. The development of this aircraft was funded by the United States, United Kingdom and several other countries. This aircraft was developed and produced by the aerospace industry led by Lockheed Martin and his two main partners Space Systems and Northrop Grumman. The first demonstration aircraft flew in 2000, and the first production version flew on December 15, 2006. Lockheed Martin, who developed this aircraft under the name F-24, was surprised to learn that this aircraft would be named F-35. On July 7, 2006, the United States Air Force officially announced the name F-35 Lighting II. This name is also used to remember the previous aircraft, namely P-38 Lightning and English Electric Lightning. Other names that have been thought of are Kestrel, Phoenix, Piazza, Black Mamba, and Spitfire II. Lighting II also became the name for the F-22 Raptor. Although several experimental designs have been developed since the 1960s such as the failed Rockwell XFV-12, the F-35B is the first operational supersonic stealth STOVL stealth fighter. The single-engine F-35 resembles the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor which is double-engined, because it takes a number of design elements from it. The engine's sewer design was inspired by General Dynamics Model 200, which was proposed for the 1972 supersonic VTOL combat requirements for marine control vessels. Lockheed Martin has suggested that the F-35 can replace the USAF F-15C D aircraft in the role of air superiority and the F-15E Strike Eagle in the role of ground attack. The company also stated that the F-35 was intended to have the second-best short-range air-to-air distance capability after the F-22 Raptor, in that the F-35 had advantages over the F-22 in basing flexibility and possessing advanced sensor capabilities and merging information. The F-35A is armed with GAU-22A, a four-barrel version of the 25mm GAU-12 equalizer. The cannon is installed internally with 182 bullets for the F-35A or in an external pod with 220 bullets for the F-35B and F-35C. The cannon pod has a stealth feature too. Software that allows operational cannon firing is expected to be installed in 2018. The F-35 has an external hardpoint for carrying missiles bombs and fuel tanks at the expense of increasing radar cross-sections and thereby reducing stealth. These include four under-wing poles that can carry AIM-120M AM raw on BVR. AGM-158 Joint Air-to-Surface Standoff Missile, JASM, Cruise Missiles Guided Bombs and two near-wing tip poles for short-range air-to-air missiles AAM, AIM-9X Sidewinder and AIM-132 ASRAAM. The F-35 has two internal weapons chambers with a total of four weapons stations. Two of them can carry air-to-ground missiles or bombs of up to 2,000 pounds 910 kilograms each in models A and C, or air missiles or bombs of up to 1,000 pounds 450 kilograms each in model B. Two other stations are for smaller weapons such as air-to-air -air missiles. The armory can carry AIM-120 AMROM, AIM-132 ASRAAM, Direct Combat Ammunition JDAM, Paveway Bomb Series Combined Standoff Weapons JSOW, Brimstone, Spear 3 Anti-Tank Missiles and Cluster Corrections Wind Corrected Munitions Dispenser Air-to-air -air missile payloads in the form of 8 AIM-120 and 2 AIM-9 can be carried using internal and external weapons stations the configuration of 6 2,000 pound 910 kilograms bombs 2 AIM-120 and 2 AIM-9 can also be arranged. The term ASMMP multi-mission pod can be used for different equipment and purposes, such as electronic warfare, aerial reconnaissance, 
or rear-facing tactical radars. The UK Ministry of Defence plans to launch the Missile Ability 3 Select Precision Effects at Range Spear from the F-35B's internal space, with four missiles stored for space. The F-22 Raptor is a stealth fighter made in the United States. This aircraft was originally planned to be an air superiority fighter for use against Soviet Union warplanes. But it was also equipped with equipment for ground attacks, electronic warfare, and intelligence signals. This aircraft went through a long development period. The prototype version was given the name YF-22, three years before it was officially used was given the name F-A-22, and finally was given the name F-22A when it was officially put into use in December 2005. Lockheed Martin Aeronautics was a contractor major responsible for producing most of the fuselage weaponry and F-22 assembly. Then its partner, Boeing Integrated Defense Systems manufactures wings, avionics equipment, and pilot training and maintenance. A variant of the M61A2 Vulcan rifle is mounted internally for proper air intake. The General Dynamics Linkless Ammunition Handling System holds 480 rounds of 20mm ammo and feeds the gun at a rate of 100 revolutions per second. The F-22 has four hooks on the wing, each rated to carry 2,270 kg, which can carry the AIM-120A MROM or an external fuel tank. Raptor has three internal weapons bays. The main weapons bay can carry six MROM AIM-120C missiles or two MROM and two 1,000 LB. GBU-32 combined direct gunpowder JDAM's attacks. The bay is equipped with an Edo Corp Lao 142, the Aval Amram Vertical Ejection Launcher which is a pneumatic ejection system, controlled by a management system. The Raytheon Amram air-to-air missile is an all-weather short-range medium for fire and forget radar missiles. Each side bay can be loaded with a Lockheed Martin, Raytheon AIM-9M or AIM-9X Sidewinder short-range air-to-air missile. GPS guided. Boeing small diameter bomb SDB was integrated on the FA-22 in February 2007. Eight NADBS can be carried out with two MROM missiles. The F-22 is designed to carry air-to-air -air missiles stored internally inside the fuselage so as not to interfere with their stealth capabilities. The launch of this missile was preceded by opening the weapon valve and then the missile was pushed down by the hydraulic system. This aircraft can also carry bombs. For example, the Joint Direct Attack Munition JDAM, and the newer, Small Diameter Bomb SDB. In addition to internal storage, this aircraft can also carry weaponry at four external points. But if this is used it will greatly reduce its stealth capabilities, speed, and agility. For backup weapons, the F-22 carries a 20mm M61A2 Vulcan automatic rifle that is stored on the right side of the aircraft. This rifle carries 480 bullets and will be discharged if it is fired continuously for about 5 seconds. Even so, the F-22 can use this rifle when fighting without being detected, which will be needed when a missile is up. The F-22A offers a full stealth, unlike the F-35 which has an excellent radar profile from the front, a profile that is less hidden from the side, and the most hidden profile from the rear quarter. Note that stealth is not transparent. This only shortens the range in which an aircraft can be detected by opponents on the ground or in the air and makes radar locks for involvement more difficult to reach and maintain. The F-22 stealth level shortens the range far from all enemy positions, even those using the new VHF radar. <laughs>